right, so I want to share something with you guys. So Jaden, my son, we got in this little, we call it a tiny boat, a uh, little 16 and a half foot starter boat. It's awesome. We got it all cleaned up, tricked out. But uh, he really wanted a Garmin live scope. And so I said, well, Christmas time and birthday and all that stuff, save up your money. Um, and he's won, you know, a couple little tournaments around the house here. So he saved his money. He got a 932 uh, HD little unit here. He needs to clean his screen. And yesterday, him and his buddy fished a little tournament here. Uh, so we got that all rigged up. And I wanted to share with you guys this. So Pro Guide, a new sponsor of mine for this year. Uh, I helped get him this battery. It's a 12 volt lithium, uh, just a 50 amp hour battery. And so what we did was run the live scope and the box to that battery and it worked phenomenal all day. He was running that thing. And then also we got this little uh, one bank charger to charge the lithium battery. It's really cool, uh, lightweight. I don't know if you can see the name there, but that's all part of uh, Pro Guide batteries and uh, worked out really good for him. Problem is the fish just weren't biting at 43 degree water, but they actually caught one. Me and my partner, we caught nothing, but uh, just a little update. So that battery right there is real lightweight. We actually have it in this little rod locker here. And uh, it is approximately seven inches by six inches. So, uh, you know, if you're looking for a battery just to run your live scope, that's the one you need because you know, he had that thing, like I said, all day, he never put it in sleep. We just wanted to test out, see how it did. He got home, charged it up, only took a few minutes, well, probably 30 minutes, and the battery was back to 100%. So just something I wanted to share with you guys.